As he nagged the door to Talbot. Gets a good look at a three around the screen. And we got a whistle and a foul. And Talbot goes down. I didn't see anybody even closer on that shot. But we'll see what happens here. It's a good screen over on that side to free up Talbot. And it's really hard to tell. Talbot got the kick out, and there was really nobody near when she released. But we'll see what happens on the follow through. You got As the wind knocked out of her or something, and she's grimacing. The, the officials are going to review what happened oh, no, over there. Now she's limping. That is unfortunate for Stephanie Talbot. Good Let's screen take a look on here. the reversal. She comes baseline here to your left. Lavender. Get some space. Oh, yep. Ooh, That's yep. going to be elevated. Absolutely. And that is exactly why the rule is in place, so you don't go with your foot underneath the shooter. A couple of times this year, the refs have been on it. When you put, as a defender, when you put your foot underneath and the shooter cannot land, it is a dangerous and vulnerable position for the shooter. And this is when injuries happen, and they can be significant injuries. Right now, Stephanie Talbot out on the court. And the good news about potentially stay in this game. A flagrant one, so Stephanie Talbot will get an opportunity here 